Good morning, I'm Lisa Mateo. Some more sunshine on the way for today. And how high will those temperatures get? We'll have that in just a bit. And also on your roadways this morning, looking pretty good. We do have a couple problem spots. We'll tell you all about that coming up. I'm hearing perhaps uh, 80, 81, all right, something let's, like that. Let's check in on those rumors with Lisa Mateo doing double duty weather That's and traffic. Right. Hi, Lisa. Yeah, good morning, guys. It definitely feels more like June. That's what it's going to feel like today rather than April. Temperatures already. I mean, the city's already at 63 degrees right now. The good news is that we don't have any 30s on the map like we did at this same time yesterday. Tom's River is at 55 degrees, whereas yesterday they were in the 30s. Poughkeepsie, you're at 48. Islip, you're at 49 degrees right now. So as far as today, not too bad out there. It's going to be a simple day to yesterday. We'll have the sunshine for today. Uh, as you can see, high pressure still in control. The only thing you're watching is this right here. This is a cold front and this will come through for tomorrow. So you could have a slight shower for tomorrow. As far as today, you are fine temperature wise. It's going to be incredible out there. So your temperatures, let's get to the other map. Sorry, Joe, my clicker is not working here. Uh, there you go. Day planner for today. You can see plenty of sunshine straight across the board. And yes, you see it 80 degrees, except if you're along the, the shore, like Long Island, the South Shore, you do have a Southwest wind. So keep in mind those temperatures could remain into the 60s for today. But we'll break it all down for you coming up in just a bit. For now, let's head over to your roadways this morning and start with the Grand Central Parkway. This is westbound at the Kew Gardens Interchange. And you can see we do have some issues here, but not too bad, not causing any delays from this accident as of yet. All right, another problem spot we do have is the Gothels Bridge, where we do have some construction. It is starting to clear. You see we have some slight delays, but the good news is yeah, yes, it is starting to clear. If you're parking around town, alternate side of the street parking rules, they are suspended for the rest of the week. Craig and Calla, back to you. All right, Lisa, thank you. New this morning this nice southerly flow and we do have a front coming through and that's going to spark off some showers but the latest model run is backing off just a bit so just some light showers so let's show it to you shall we nine o'clock this morning no issues for you uh, as you go through noon time still beautiful out there temperatures in interior sections and the city into the 80s but look at long island that south facing shore you see the clouds sticking around just a bit and then you have that southwesterly flow against the water off the water and that's why you have temperatures that are cooler along the island and only into the 60s for today then we get to 5 p.m. It starts to clear out. No issues for you. Still clear. Then we start to have that front approach. And what you'll see to start the day, you have interior sections. You mix, have a mix of sun and clouds. Long Island, you're still stuck in the clouds. As we move into as this front comes through, remember, it's a, it's a front that's coming through. It's not an actual area of low pressure. So we just have these light showers to deal with around noontime. Then they're in, they're out. You can see by 2 p.m., we're already starting to clear out for parts of New Jersey. And then by 5 p.m., we're back into the sunshine once again. Temperatures do start start to drop down going into Thursday behind that front, uh, but it's still above normal. Temperatures into the 60s, which is not too bad for this time of the season. 62 to be exact for Thursday. Friday, plenty of sunshine, 63 degrees. By Saturday, a few clouds roll in, 65 degrees. And so far for Easter, if you're making plans, we could have a few scattered showers, but it's just scattered, not a washout. Uh, 72 degrees. And then by Monday, we're sticking into the 70s as well. So every day above normal in our seven day. Not too bad. All right, let's head to your roadways and show you what's going on around town. We're the Torres is working the night shift, so we're filling in right now. Southern State Parkway eastbound. We do have an accident. This is by exit 21, and this is Nassau Road, so it's blocking two lanes right now. So this is a Southern State Parkway. We did have that earlier accident on the Northern State Parkway, and that one has cleared out. So that's the good news there. Delays and service changes right now on the 17J and M line. So if that's your way to work, just keep that in mind. You will have some delays this morning to deal with over on these lines for your subways. All right, as far as transit, everything else running on schedule. MTA, LIRR, New Jersey Transit and your path is running on time this morning. Alternate side of the street parking rules, they are suspended for today and for the rest of the week. We'll send it back to you. All right, Lisa, thank you. Of course, Lisa has great... <laughs> Stop keeping him hostage. This bumping it out. He just wanted to make sure his bike was okay. Yeah. She wasn't stealing it. I know, that was a very expensive bike. <laughs> you know, thank you. Uh, because we do have a few showers on the way for tomorrow, so enjoy today. Uh, 63 degrees, that's where we're at right now in the city, so it's not bad out there at all. It's already feeling nice. Everyone else in the 50s right now, so everyone's come about, we've had the... Everyone's come about, we've had the 40s, there. we're into the 50s right now, and this... And we're into the 50s right now, and this... And we're into the 50s right now, and this... And we're into the 50s right now, and this time we're into the 50s right now, and this time we're into the 50s right now, and the 60s, so it's a nice start to your day. Tom's River... All 
3 degrees, those temperatures are definitely going to rise uh, for interior sections and for the city for today, getting into the 80s. Satellite radar picture is clear. It looks nice out there. We have high pressure control for today, which is off the coast, so we have this nice southerly flow, so we have this nice warm air from the Gulf, and this is the cold front that we're watching for tomorrow. The latest model run has actually backed off a little bit and just has a few light showers, and that's about it. So today, again, beautiful, 80 degrees, but keep in mind, south-facing areas of the shore, uh, you will have temperatures that are slightly cooler into the 60s because you have that wind off the water. Uh, Wednesday, that's when we do have the scattered showers, but again, very, very light showers. Temperatures still above normal, 73 degrees, and then by Thursday, plenty of sunshine, 62 degrees, which is still not bad. All right, let's get another check of your roadways this morning because we do have a couple areas that we want to tell you about. Starting off the BQE, this is one, uh, the Bell Parkway westbound, uh, that was one problem, but this is over at the beacon, that went really quick. There we go, Bell Parkway westbound by exit 18, Lefferts Boulevard. This is that accident, and then again, this is westbound, so keep that in mind, you could have some delays starting to build here. On top of that, the Bells Parkway, if you're headed eastbound, this is by exit 11, this is over at Flatbush Avenue, and this accident, you can see how far the delays do stretch back this morning, and that one is blocking that left lane this morning. So just keep that in mind. If that's your way to work, you're going to have some issues out there. Tapping the brakes. Alternate side of the street parking rules, they are suspended for today. We'll send it back to you. All right, Lisa, thank you. A United Airlines passenger being dragged off a plane. Still up the coast with this nice southerly flow. So one more summer-like day. It's going to feel like June as opposed to April for today, except for that south-facing shore. Just keep that in mind. Because you have the wind off the water, water temperature is about into the 40s right now. So that's why you will remain cooler. And you have a few clouds that will stick around as well. Tomorrow, this cold front comes through. Now, it's a front. It's not an organized system. So just a few light showers. That's all from this. And temperatures will remain mild. They'll be into the 70s for tomorrow. Now, as we start to move into Thursday, high pressure moves in behind it. So you have this sunshine that returns. But t temperatures return to seasonable, where they should be for this time of the year, uh, into the 60s, which is still not bad, a little bit above uh, where they should be. 62 degrees to be exact. Friday, 60 three degrees by Saturday, 65 degrees. And so far for Easter, if you're making plans, just some scattered showers, not a heavy downpour, some scattered showers to deal with. But temperatures still mild at 72 degrees. And by Monday, we're sticking into the 70s. I'll send it back to you. All right, Lisa, thanks. One